yeah, uh, still it's really enjoyable. But we're going to get into this final episode. We're going to start in three, two, one, play. You probably heard my mouse click. That's when I press play. So, yeah. Here we go. Here we go. And I think we will get another season of this eventually. So I'm not just like, oh, I think this is going to be the end or anything. But Okay. Reject what we fear. Okay. Yeah, the freaking slaughter we saw in the previous episode. That was... It's crazy. It's crazy. <clears throat> oh, Biba, what the fuck? Oh, yeah, the shit with Mume that went on in the previous episode, too. Oh, here's opening. Opening. So I guess I could talk to you guys while the opening's going. Some people are saying an OVA in second season confirmed. Is that for Cabanari? Chibi hates Cabanari because of Biba. It's been on a downward spiral, honestly. I'll be straight up honest with you. Like It's still been enjoyable, everyone, but with the introduction of Biba, yeah, I, I just haven't been feeling it as of late, but what if we get Cabanari season two before Attack on Titan season two? My God, that would be crazy. That'd be crazy. Oh, man. I got to close out all some of this shit. I love this freaking opening. Yes. Dun, 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 dun. Cool. Yes, yes. Yes. No done now. Their schedule's packed until jeez, that is crazy. Craziness. All right, here we go. Here we go. Opening's about over. Here we go. Here we go. Episodes called the Kotatsujo, the last episode of season one. I do think we will get more, honestly, eventually. But we'll see. Oh. Oh, shit. Yes, the new hairstyle, the new do, and everything. Oh, man. Yo, you are touching my boy, Koma. You are not. Oh, my God. Look, I love this new look, honestly, of him. Kursu as well. Who I've came to love. I didn't like him at first, but oh my, yo, holy shit, the duo right now. This is all for freaking Takumi as well. You know he has that thought in his mind, like what happened to Takumi? I still want to think that dude's alive. I I don't think he is, but Psh. easy pickings here. You know, you already know that OST is freaking. Oh, look at that. Oh, shit. You're, you're a Cabinari. Yep. That's that's some straight up real shit right there, Kursu. I love that. He said, "If you turn into a Kabane, a full, you know, gone Kabane, I will kill you." That's what he said to him. That is some real shit. With only one left, you can save either yourself or Mume. Whoa. Yeah, it's like this freaking scientist or doctor came out of nowhere with that serum. We know we did see them jump off the cliff with um, Kursuru, like Kursuru and the scientist dude or whatever jumped off together back a while ago. I think that was, yeah, it was them. Oh, yeah, man. Yeah, Biba caused freaking just straight up craziness everywhere with, with what he did. 
to the freaking Shogun and just the reaction from everybody and seeing that. Yo. Our doubting hearts and mind, Ayami, man. That's why you got to love her. That's why you got to love her. That's why kind of Mume's taking a back seat as of late because Ayami's freaking stepped to the plate and Mume's just <clears throat> kind of went down the shitter as of late. Still love my girl, though, but she's just been out of it lately. You, you can't deny that. Oh, my God. Oh. Holy shit. Yeah, so this is Mume in here. Oh, there's that, that butterfly. Oh, shit. Why are you alive? You killed so many. You can die too. Oh my gosh. Holy fuck. Look how... And it even has like the, the wings of like a butterfly. It is... Oh shit. Oh shit. Yo, he's saying it can't be. It, it can fucking be. Look who's... Oh man, look who we just saw. Ecoma. Ecoma, dude. Yes, yes. Look at that look in his face. Look at that. Oh, the look in the man's face. Yo. He's only here for Mume and Biba, you know, to rescue Mume, but to fucking slaughter Biba, dude. Yes. Oh man. Yo, Cursor. I've gained so much more respect for this man over the over the episodes as I went along. Dude, it's just too easy for him right now. Uh, I want to see this Sahari dude freaking go up against Ikoma and uh, the faded, you know, meet up with Biba again. Oh shit. Oh, fuck. Damn. Yo. Uh-oh. And the fucking train's about to ram him. No. No way. What the f... Yo! He just fucking... He just picked up the whole fucking train himself and... F Yo. How the fuck did he do that? I mean, that's at least what I it looked like to me. Like, he just fucking flipped that whole train over his head. And he says, oh, don't worry. I'm still a cabinari. Holy shit, though. Oh, there's Sahari, man. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, dude, look at Ikoma's arm. It's like. Holy shit. And like, you know, half of his face, of course. Holy shit. You killed too many. So, oh. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you know, you don't. He does not break. Uh, the, sun's, the sun wants to leave now. I probably look a lot darker right now, but. Oh, shit. Destruction, chaos everywhere, dude. It, this... He, he took freaking easy care of Sahara, so... Oh, man. A dying man is calling me. Oh, fuck. I honestly don't know how they're going to wrap this up. This first season. Is this how it's been? How it's flowed so far, this final episode? Holy shit. That's a lot of Kabane. Yo, is Cursor about to go in? He's telling Ikoma to go on. Yo. Dude, look at... 
Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. The weak part of me can never return. See, it is kind of BS in a sense. And she's still on this brother thing, brother thing. Your brother lied to you. Your brother's fucking possessed you pretty much. And just, oh man. Oh. Yo, there's that one, that blue butterfly. No way. What the f Was it that simple? Did he just have to show up like that? I love his new do, though. <laughs> that new cut is slick as hell, I gotta say. His new look. I'm going to turn you back now, he says. What the? Oh. 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 Who is it? Fucking Biba. Yo, I hope Ikoma fucking slaughters this dude. Like, oh, man, there's the freaking mid card. Here we go. Biba and Ikoma. Biba and Ikoma. We've all been waiting for this again. Well, they didn't really have like a, you know, they weren't like fighting before, but we've been waiting for this. I've been waiting to see this freaking dude Biba get. Ooh, yo. Holy shit, dude. Holy shit. Ikoma, please, please fucking. Oh, just freaking crush this dude, please. That's all I can say, honestly. I, I want to see him die. A hundred percent. A hundred freaking million percent. Holy. Ooh. Damn. There's them. Yeah, because Mume is like in the middle of all of this right now. She, she. I don't think she knows what the fuck's going on. She may. There's that one, that one blue butterfly that's, you know, showing, symbolizing a coma most likely. Oh, shit. I think we'll see Mume somehow break out of this or realize what the fuck is going on. Yo, look at that look on his face. It was going to be nobody else but you, Ikoma, to end him. Yo, holy shit. Ikoma, please. Ooh. Oh, my. Oh, he just fucking snapped his arm. Oh. Oh my goodness, you hear, oh, you heard, what the, yo, he is totally, holy sh, what the, f what the hell just happened? What the f Yo, that was maybe, like, one of the weirdest things I've ever seen in my life. Like, he just stopped. It might have been something with Mume, or... What the f... Fuck just happened? Was it Biba's doing? Did he do this? Or something fucking... Okay, yeah. Oh. Oh. Holy shit. Was that all it took? Look at the fucking arm. Okay. Okay. Um. Oh, my God. Oh, there's a serum. That blue butterfly. Yo, I like the track. I don't know how I feel about what the fuck just, you know, played out. But, you know, it's good to see Mume, I guess, freed. Even though it may have been in a BS way. But, oh my gosh. That fight, was it just me? Or was that, what, did you want to see more? Like that was kind of an anti uh, climatic fight. I don't know what the hell happened there. I I'm figuring it had something to do with Mume and the, you know that stone she dropped. 
Ah, Mume. Damn. Yep, there it is. Coma's out of it. Holy shit. Holy shit. Oh, he's still up? Oh. Oh, shit. The man is still up and fighting. And look at his face, too. He's dead ass serious. He usually has a different ass look on his face. And now he's. Ooh. Really? What? <laughs> I told you to stop. Oh, it just took all this time. I wish you would. Come on, Mume. Yo. Okay. <laughs> I'm with some of the people who said this is kind of some bullshit. But. Oh, gosh. Please do not feel bad for this guy. Don't. Please, no. Mume. Hosumi. Hosumi. You're Hosumi. Yeah, that is some bullshit. That is some bullshit, honestly. I'm conflicted right now. Like, it's, it's like, you know, how it played out was sick, but also BS at the same time. Like, it was, you know, no doubt about it. The fight was fucking great, but pretty anticlimactic, I'd say. And uh, just straight bullshit, honestly. Oh, uh oh, make a deal. Exchange for telling you to escape route. You let us on the coat. But it's how Mume can still like see her brother in this way. Like it, it doesn't make any sense, dude. And I thought Ecoma out of everyone be the would be the one to end him, you know. But it ended out being Mume, I guess. So they're trying to strike a deal here. The stray cabin and your loyal dog are both here. So what are these people going to be on? Oh man. Look at his shoulder. Like, you just see, he's, he literally, like, a part of his body looks like he's a fucking cabinet or a zombie. Literally. Oh, my gosh. Mume, sh oh, I'm sorry. I, I've lost a lot of respect and love for Mume, like, especially in the second half of the series, man. <laughs> signal is good. <laughs> he didn't say that, but he said signal. <laughs> oh, he's getting stuck with this. Oh. So Ikoma's just out of it right now. And we're moving along. Moving along, it seems like. Yukina. Oh, man. I love Yukina. So is this how we're going to end off season one here? She has that gun now. God, please just... Oh, my God. Why would you even, like... No. No. Biba does not deserve a freaking, like, funeral or anything, dude. You just need to fucking like, chop them up and freaking burn them or some shit. Oh. Damn. Holy shit. I do love seeing Mume like this, though, honestly. <sighs> Moving along. Hmm. 
Mm-hmm. Like almost sitting up, it seemed like right there. Oh. Ah. Uh, that is sweet. That is sweet. I must admit, that is sweet. Yeah, we're home after a bunch of bullshit. So what are they just launching him? Oh, holy fuck. He just, she whipped that. Okay. All right. Curse through, man. Yo, you are the man. Curse through. I, I've gained so much more respect for you, honestly, dude. Also, Ayami as well. Ah. Uh, that is awesome. Biba, fuck that dude. Mume, I liked. I, I still like her, but it's just she definitely from like the midway point when Biba was introduced to the end of the series, she says, man, like she is just so dumb sometimes, like really. And she's like still feeling for her brother. And she like made him like this. I'll oh, put flowers over his body and stuff and cover him up. Like, no, dude. Like, look. Yeah, his freaking body deserves to be freaking crushed in rocks and shit. He deserves a fucking shit ton of debris over him. <laughs> and I guess that's how we're going to leave off. <laughs> He's going to wake up. There's no way he doesn't. But how this is ending off, I definitely see us getting more, honestly. There's definitely a lot more we have to explore, other places we have to be, other places we have to go, because we're still moving along here, obviously, as you can see. You're my shield, so you can't die. Oh. <laughs> uh, damn. Stop shaking me. What a way to wake up, right? Ah. Uh, that is kind of cute, though. You know, because Ikoma was out to do that. I love Ikoma. Ikoma's a fucking awesome main character, and he was out to, you know, save this girl, Mume. He was a fucking lost idiot in the second half of the series, so... Oh. Wow. Ah, uh, look at that visual. Wow, that is beautiful. That is beautiful. Crew. Gotta love the Kotetsujo crew, man. A lot of the members on it. Ah. Uh. That is cute. I, I must say that is cute. Even though Mume is like 12. <laughs> Nikoma's, you know, like five or six years older than her. I think that may be all right in Japan. I don't know. But guess that's how they're leaving us off. There definitely has to be more. I mean, we are getting two recap movies, a special ending. Yeah, that is it. That is it, everyone. All right, so...